Once upon a time, in a lush, vibrant forest filled with the songs of birds and the rustling of leaves, there lived a courageous frog named Charlie. Charlie wasn't just any frog. He was known throughout the forest for his daring leaps and kind heart. His best friend was a wise old turtle named Fred, who shared many adventures with him. They were an unlikely pair, but their friendship knew no bounds. One fateful day, while exploring the outskirts of the forest, something terrible happened. Fred was captured by a human who wanted to take him away and keep him as a pet. The human thought Fred was so unique that he couldn't resist putting him in a cage and taking him away. Charlie, who had been scouting ahead, returned to find Fred gone, with only a set of strange tracks leading away, feeling a mix of fear and determination. Charlie decided he would do whatever it took to bring his friend back home. He knew the journey would be full of challenges, but he also knew that the power of their friendship could overcome any obstacle. Charlie followed the tracks as they led out of the forest and into the unknown. Along the way, he enlisted the help of various forest creatures. There was Bella, the fast-flying sparrow, who scouted ahead to find the path they should take. Spike, the protective porcupine, offered his spines for protection against any dangers they might face. And Daisy, the gentle deer, used her knowledge of the lands beyond the forest to guide them on their way. Together, they encountered many obstacles, rivers too wide to cross, mountains too steep to climb, and fields that stretched as far as the eye could see. But for every challenge, Charlie found a solution. Inspired by the memories of his adventures with Fred, he remembered how Fred would use his shell to help bridge gaps or provide shelter, and in doing so, Charlie found innovative ways to mimic his friend's ingenuity. Finally, after a long and arduous journey, they reached a house at the edge of a strange and bustling village. It was here that Fred was being kept. Charlie and his team waited until nightfall, under the cover of darkness, to make their move. Bella and Spike created a distraction at the front of the house, while Charlie and Daisy sneaked into the backyard where Fred was held captive. Charlie found Fred in a small cage, looking sad and alone. Fred's eyes lit up when he saw Charlie his hope rekindled by the sight of his dear friend. Using a clever trick Fred had once taught him, Charlie used a nearby stick to jimmy the lock open and free Fred from his cage. But their escape was not yet secure. The noise of the cage opening alerted the human, and they had to think fast. In a display of teamwork and quick thinking, Spike rolled up into a ball, and Bella carried him in the air, dropping him just in time to startle the human and give them a chance to escape. Together, they raced back through the fields, over the mountains, and across the rivers, with the knowledge of the way home burning bright in their hearts. The journey back was tough, but the thought of returning to their forest home with Fred safe and sound gave them the strength to push forward. As they finally stepped back into the familiar embrace of the forest, the first light of dawn painted the sky in hues of gold and pink. They were greeted by the cheers and relief of their forest friends, who had been anxiously awaiting their return. Charlie and Fred, standing side by side, looked out at the faces of those they had saved and those who had helped save them. They knew that this adventure had strengthened the bonds of their friendship and shown them the true power of working together. From that day forward, Charlie and Fred's story was told and retold among the trees and rivers of the forest. It became a tale of bravery, ingenuity, and the unstoppable force of friendship. And as for Charlie and Fred, they continued to explore the forest and beyond, knowing that no matter what challenges lay ahead, they would face them together, as best friends always do. And so, the forest remained a place of magic and wonder, where the power of friendship was the greatest magic of all.